Just a few chords. The first one is an A minor seven. So basically, you can have your middle finger or whatever finger works for you on the second fret of the D string. Index finger is going to be on the first fret of the B string. Now we're going to go to a, what is this, B minor 7? Yeah. So basically a B minor, but you lift up your pinky. If you don't know, bar from the A string down, and then the second fret, middle finger is going to go on the third fret of the B string. Ring finger is going to go on the fourth fret of the D string right there. So you don't have to hit the top string on this one. And now you're going to go to a C major 7. Really easy. It's just a C chord, but you're not on that first fret. So uh, ring finger on the A string, third fret. Middle finger on the D string, second fret. The rest are open. All right, so let's go over what we got so far. The A minor 7. B minor 7 to the C major 7. Now back to the uh, A minor 7. Then B minor 7 again. Now you're going to go to an E minor. Then to an E minor 7. All you do is... Uh, well, first of all, the E minor is on the second fret of the A and D string. And all you do to make it a seven, the E minor seven, is lift off of that D string. Okay, so we got, uh, from the very beginning, it goes A minor seven, B minor seven, C major seven, A minor seven, E minor 7, E minor, E minor 7, then it repeats. So when it goes to the alone, it's going to be A minor, the, uh, it's just going to be A minor, 7, B minor 7, to the E minor, then E minor 7, and it'll do that twice. Alone again, alone again, Then it goes back to the original, A minor 7, B minor 7, C major 7. So I uh, hope y'all got it down. Let me know if there's anything else I need to clarify about the song. Yeah, fun one.